the network. Okay, bet. I'm a little bit confused though. So one, you said you want to come off as a diverse artist. Well, I guess like I, it's not like I, I, that's like my aim, but I feel like until I found find like a, a particular sound, I think that there's like I think in in some ways I do have a diver, diverse type aspect, or maybe I'm looking at the word diverse, you know, what I'm saying wrong as far as uh, production, because like I think basically I feel like I'm capable of doing some upbeat sound, but then I, I'm also capable of doing a slow, you know, what I'm saying more uh lyrical type music you know what i'm saying but then i also feel like i can every now and then have like a, a club type record which i'm not so concerned about that so i guess my question should be should it it, it be to focus on that one side of it it just just as far as um production and like lyrical content should it just be that one focus and then later on maybe introducing different sounds um, would you, you consider yourself probably on the Kendrick Lamar side of things, right? Yeah, more so, yeah. All right, so let's look at Kendrick. Would you consider him a diverse artist just to get your idea of what diversity is? Yeah, yeah, I would feel like he's like a diverse artist. All right. In my so, opinion. All right, and I agree. I agree that he's diverse. He's just not... He's not what people are usually thinking when they're saying, I want to be diverse, right? right? But he's definitely, he has the capability to do a lot of different things. Uh, right. But he still stays within a Kendrick pocket, right? He has a Kendrick point of view, a Kendrick way of going about things. And that part needs to be consistent, right? right. This whole, a lot of these sounds and these other things that people are associate with diversity are usually superficial. And you need to figure out what's going to be more so that constant of, or at least having that identity and your own voice that you're consistent with more than anything. I was just at an event last night in Love Renaissance. One of the guys on that team who they've done a few, a few, a few artists and he was like one of the main thing they look for because somebody asked him what do they look for an artist. He was like, he's looking for a point of view and a voice. Those two things, which I was like, you know, I've said this for a long time. So it's, that's going to be the thing that makes you matter and make people understand who you are. So first get that part out the way. Like understand those two things are, are more important than this sonic diversity and production for diversity. Mm. Secondly, the other thing is, let's think about Kendrick Lamar. Section 80. You ever listen to Section 80? Yeah, um, not like heavy, but I have though. Yeah. All right. So one thing about Section 80, it's not like every single song is the exact same amount of BPMs or something like that. But there's a consistent energy in that project. Right. You know what I mean? And I think one thing that people have to really associate more than anything when we start to think about di whether diversity, the energy is more important then also some of that production and stuff. What I mean by that is, like, once I'm getting into a certain, if I'm a certain person who likes a certain type of mood, certain type of feel and message, then when I'm in that pocket, I'm in that pocket. And that energy-wise, it's the same pocket, but maybe some of the son sonics might be slightly different, right? The beat might not use the exact same, you know, placement on the drum pad or something like that. Right. But at the same time, it's along the same lines. Uh, the, the lines in terms of energy and so if you could have an overall energy that you produce and that you bring which is probably going to also relate and come from your perspective and your point um, and your voice then that'll be something more to aim for than thinking all of my beats need to sound the same or it has to sound like this cohesive project like a, out, the whole cohesion thing is more of a okay i'm working on an album or would i have a specific message and concept that i want to express but when we're talking about just having your own pocket and identifiable sound outside of the, the point of view and the voice is really more so like, well, what's that energy that I go to you to bring? Ow.